So today we're gonna take the time to show you the b -b bright side of the dark side of Pokemon. Wherein Pokemon will die. Not my Pokemon though, because I'm smirt. I'm smirt in the herd. Okay. When last we left off, we had passed two kung fu looking dudes that we can no longer get back to. On account of there's all these uh, ledges in the way. And I did reload an older save state and went back to them. And as people had mentioned in the comments, they teach... Um, what do they teach? Mega Punch and Mega Kick. Which... None of my Pokemon can learn. So, you know, no harm, no foul. So now here we are in Cerulean City. On our way to Cerulean City. That's not how the song goes. The people here were robbed. It's obvious that Team Rocket is behind this most heinous crime. Brother. <laughs> this is like Hulk Hogan Jr. Even our police force is trouble with the rockets. Those Houston... <coughs> Excuse me, wow. I was... There were some really good songs on the radio on my way home from work, and because it's Friday, I was singing, and now my voice hurts. If that slow bro wasn't there, you could cut down the small tree. That way you could get to the other side. I think there's a way around it, though. Yes, the way around this slow bro is through it, ironically. I want a bright red bicycle. I want a bright new shiny bicycle. You have a brand new key. That's a wrong song, but I'll keep it at home so it won't get dirty. Yes, that is what we shall do with bicycles. It's like Jay Leno's car collection. Why ever drive it? You're making an encyclopedia on Pokemons. That sounds as amusing. <laughs> I add all kinds of extra S's. A plain city bike is good enough for me. After all, you can't put a shopping basket on a mountain bike. You totally can put a basket on a mountain bike. I had a mountain bike in junior high school, and I had the big baskets on the back, the, the ones that flank the rear tire. It was awesome. People could go for rides on it. Get over here, you little kid. These bikes are cool, but they're way expensive. The shopkeepers pretty much not have a handle on uh, free market economics. Hi, welcome to our bike shop. Have we got just the bike for you? It's one million thingamajiggers. Sorry, you can't afford it. C thank you. Come back again sometime. And for all of you Europeans out there, notice that there's two commas in the price. That's because the comma separates the hundreds and the thousands and the millions, and a decimal point separates the decimals. That's why it's called a decimal point, not a decimal comma. That's exactly why. Oh, let's go in this house. All kinds of people to talk to. Why, hello there. Do you happen to have a Poliwhirl? I don't, actually. Would you agree to trade it for my Jinx? I don't have one, so I can't. Well, if you don't want to, it's not a matter of wanting to or not. It's a matter of I don't have one. Can you even have a Poliwhirl at this point in the game? My husband likes trading Pokemon. You're collecting Pokemon for your Pokedex, aren't you? My uh, old woman voice is just as good as my old man voice, isn't it? Would you please trade with him? He keeps going on and on, and I want to poison his coffee. That's kind of sad. You're a trainer too? Collecting, battling, it's a tough life, isn't it? Well, I can tell you, it's a hard knock life for us. What do you have to say for yourself? Slow bro, prunt. <laughs> Wait a minute, turn off turbo. Okay, slow bro, use sonic boom. Come on, slow bro, pay attention. Okay, Slowbro, you Sonic Boom. Oh, we already saw that one. Slowbro, withdraw! No, that's wrong. It's so hard to control a Pokemon. Your Pokemon's obedience depends on your abilities as a trainer. Yes, how fast and how hard can you whip them? Slowbro, punch! No, you blew it again. You suck, Slowbro. Slowbro took a snooze. It's going to keep inhaling for a while because it's slow. That's the joke. What do you have to say for yourself, old man? Ah, oh, too much time, too little to do. Is nothing entertaining happening anywhere? I might as well just die. Repel not only keeps bugs away, it also works on weak Pokémon. Put your strongest Pokémon at the left of the Pokémon list. If your first Pokémon is strong, Repel's effect is boosted. How do you know that it's to the left of the list? What if I read right to left? Then shouldn't the right Pokémon p position be the strongest? I don't know. And uh, Repel's effects are boosted just like 
Ritonavir boosts protease inhibitors' powers. Oh, that's a pharmacy thing, and that's kind of what I do now. Do you know about rare candy? They don't sell it in shops. I think it makes Pokemon grow very quickly all of a sudden. I think it's made by the Anabolic Steroid Company, and it rots their teeth. Wee. All right, get out of here. That wasn't quite as good of a joke. Rare candy as steroids is a funny joke, though. Hi, can I help you? Why, yes, I would like to buy some of your finest Pokeballs. Six, please. Yes, I have plenty of these money thingies that you were... I'll take two of those. Yes, and what else? Do I have an antidote? I have plenty of those. Paraly... I don't really care about Paralyze. Ah, let's get an... Yeah, I want an Awakening. I would like a Burn Heal. Thank you. Do I have my Escape Rope still? I got two of those. And I have a Repel. I'll take one more. A grassy Ass. And that's it. And, ooh, do I have stuff to sell? I think I do have some star pieces to sell. Wow! I will take all of those thingies that you're going to give me that lets me trade for for food and shelter and other various things. If a star piece is worth 4900 how much is a nugget worth? Because in the original game, nuggets were like 5000 And that was a lot. But that right there was almost 5000 What does this sign say? Trainer can be made to hold an item. Ooh, yay! Pokemon can hold items. I don't care. Pokemon have opposable thumbs. So here we can go through... Have we talked to this man yet? Only skilled trainers can collect Pokemon badges. I see you have at least one. Those badges have amazing secrets, did you? They didn't feel like programming in the fact that you might have two badges the first time you speak to this man. He's like, I know in order to reach this city, you must have defeated Brock in Pewter City. Therefore, you must have at least one badge. Now then, which of the eight badges should I describe? None of the above. Come visit me anytime you wish, of course. And here's his backyard, and there's nothing going on in it at the moment. And I click the buttons, and nothing happens. Ooh, get in the door. <laughs> there, oh, man, how many people have seen the old Charlie Brown cartoon where he's visiting France, and he's trying to get through the door with a big loaf of French bread? I watched that as a child, and I remember as a small child getting so angry at Charlie for not figuring out that you can turn the piece of bread to walk through the door. I was like, I was angry at him for being so stupid. Now, I know what happens if I go north here. If you don't know what happens when you go north, let's just say that double rainbow all the way. I concoct a variety of medicines from berry powder. Uh, no. Welcome to the closest thing to a pharmacy in all of uh, Pokemon, and I'm not going to pay any attention because there were no berries in the first game. I'm kind of in the mood to catch another Pokemans. I have no clue what level the Pokemans in this uh, area are. And Gertrude, you know, it's kind of a dumb idea to start with Gertrude. If we want to catch a Pokemon, I suppose leading with Gally or Densetsu is the best choice on account of they have moves that make people stop uh, attacking you. But, alright, here goes nothing. And we have another Rattata. Only this time it's a boy Rattata. Aw oh, yeah. Sleep powder. What? You think you can quick attack me, son? Alright, so now that he's asleep, well, I mean, he's a Rattata. Bag. Pokeball. Go. You got out of the Pokeball? I don't think I like that. Okay, now you're in trouble. Densetsu, get in here. Tackle him. Ooh, I don't like that. Stun Spore. There we go. Tackle him again. And now I'm unhappy. Pokemon, who's got a lot of hit points? Galley has a lot of hit points. Get back in there, Galley. And now a Pokeball. And how do you feel now, stupid rat boy? Would you like to give a nickname to him? Why, yes. And I think I've already got a nickname for him. How about Rat Boy? On account of he's a boy and a rat. And start. Yay, Rat Boy's in the PC. Now, turn back on the turbo. And, oh, man, one step away. You chose a bad time, rat girl. Time to die. Okay. Pokemon's switch 
to we wanted uh, Susu Studio in the front because Susu Studio needs to gain some levels. And I have just like every rat in the game. There are no Rattata that are not actually my Pokemon. And there we go. And go up here, boot up the PC. We're going to go into someone's and we are going to... I like move. I don't understand why there's a deposit and a withdraw when move does the same thing and has a lot more options. But, okay, so we're going to go here. We're going to go to summary. He has a lonely nature and I thought ahead and opened it up. Increases attack and decreases defense. Ooh. Decreasing defense is scary only because it's a Nuzlocke run. But increasing attack. I'm so tempted. And he's got guts. Do I want to replace Gerbtrude with Ratboy? Hmm. I mean, he's a little bit higher level already, so I can immediately put him into the party a little bit faster. Okay, turn that off. Get up in here. Rattata, Gerbtrude, summary. And what was she? She was calm. And calm is special defense in exchange for attack. So, unfortunately, Gerbtrude, unfortunately, into the box with you. Shift. Ooh, that's kind of cute looking. And put the boy Rattata in place. And now Galley is all kinds of offended. He is upset. Galley is like just raging. No, he's not. Galley's like, yo, bro, what's up? And the rat boy's like, rat, 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 rat. I don't know what ratatas do. Chirp, 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 chirp. Little ratty sound. I'm terrible right now. I can't even think of a ratty sound. This does not seem like a good matchup for me. Ooh, it suddenly looked better. Astonish. Oh, it's a normal type Pokemon. It is a bad matchup for me. Get in there, Barbara. Oh no, you growled at me. How about I peck your eyes out? How about I peck your other eye out and get a critical hit and your brain explodes? How do you feel now? Huh, bird brain? Whee! And there's a Rattata. Supersonic the Rattata. And Leech Life the Rattata. Ooh, that was pretty nice. I could deal with another one of those if you wouldn't mind. Holy crap. Get out of there now. Just, oh my gosh, get out of there too. I can't, I cannot take on wild Rattatas. They're just so tricky. They, they come out of nowhere with these critical hits and Rattata have such high speed and attack that they just wipe you out. All right, so we got ones, which is good. I like the ones, they're better than zeros. Everybody else can gain some points, and we're going to go back and heal after, like, what, two fights? We took on a Spearow and a Rattata, and now we have to run back to the Pokemon Center. You guys are my hero, did you know that? Did you ever know that you're my hero? You're everything I wish I could be. Why couldn't I have caught a Sand Shrew? That would have been awesome. Wait. Oh. I thought flying and ground interacted a little bit differently than that, on account of one is flying and one is ground. Oh, let's try Fury Attack. Ooh, that worked out really well. I could see you doing that a little bit more often, Barbara. Fury, Fury. Okay, if you could Fury a little bit more than twice. Or, you know, at all. There we go. No, still not, not, not digging it there, Barbara. Come on. I'm going to gain a level with you just so I can stop using you for a moment. And I don't mean that in a mean way. Oh, Fury Attack. Three times. I hate you so much, Rattata. You have no clue how much I just despise you. You are the killer of all Nuzlocke Pokemon. And if I could, I would release a virus that would destroy every Rattata on Earth. No, 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 not you, Ratchel. Maybe Rat Boy, but not Ratchel. Ratchel is just our awesomest Pokemon. Alright, get in here. Fighting normal type Pokemon is such a pain in the butt because... Unless you have like a fighting type, they don't really die super fast and just deal no damage because of his defense curls. 
Okay, two speed, one attack. I can live with that. Now let's get out of here for now. But what about Rat Boy? He needs more experience. You know what, Rat Boy? Shut up. You just joined the party. You gotta earn your place. How do I earn my place if you won't use me in battle? You know what? I don't think I like you pointing out my logical inconsistencies, all right? Huh? You want to deal with this? I can teach you how to deal with this. All right, so I know that the rival is going to come. Mr. Rainbow wants to fight me. And I know he's got a Charmander, and I know he has a Pidgey, and I know he has an Abra. Is that all he has? I don't know. But who should I lead with? Who's my best lead? I'll lead with Ratchel. I have total confidence in my ability to defeat the rival. Okay. We got, what do we got up here? Ooh, nothing. Hey, look, there's a Team Rocket guy. If only I could hop this fence, I'd totally whoop his butt. Oh, you know what else we could do real quick? Let's go in the gym. Why haven't we gone in the gym? Um... Do we want to give Rat Boy... You know what I want to do? This is going to be kind of bad, but we're just going to womp this gym real quick. The leader, Misty, is a pro. He uses water-type Pokemon. I would not have guessed. You can drain all their water with grass-type Pokemon. Or you can use electric-type Pokemon to zap them. You know what? If I used an electric-type Pokemon, I could kill this trainer right here. Splash, I'm first up. Let's do it. It's Michael Phelps. No, it's Swimmer Luis. He would like to battle, and he's got a horsey, and I've got a Vine Whip. Oh, mine is better. All right, special attack and defense is pretty good. Nope, I think I'm going to get Ice Beamed. Vine Whip. Yep, you're dead. <laughs> uh, that can't be. I got a silver in the 200 meter. Was it the 200 meter? What's the one that Michael Phelps lost? I don't remember. I think I want to do this. Womp. What? You? I'm more than good enough for you. Misty won't have to be bothered. Picnicker Diana would like to battle. Why are you picnicking in a pool? Vine Whip. <gasps> Wait a minute, you survived a Vine Whip? Vine Whip again. That's what I like to see. Level 19 Galley. Ooh, look at those stats. No, no, not the attack stat. Why would I want attack? You overwhelmed me! Aw, oh, man. You have to face other trainers to see how good you really are. I know how good I am. I'm good enough to beat all of you. In fact, I probably don't even need to heal Galley, but I just want to make sure that I have enough Vine Whips, because when I first played Pokemon Blue, the very first time I took on Misty, I was using a Bulbasaur, but the thing is, uh, Star you No, Star Me? Which one's the higher one? It's Star You, then Star Me. The Star Me is just... has so much defense. It's not even fun. Hi, you're a new face. <coughs> that hurts my throat so much. Only those trainers who have a policy about Pokemon can turn pro. What is your approach when you catch and train Pokemon, uh, to beat every one of the other Pokemon? My policy is an all-out offensive water-type Pokemon. You can't see it, but I'm winking right now. <gasps> Star you, whatever, Vine... Wait a minute, you get to go first? You're fast. Not Water Pulse. How will I survive? Nope. Uh, sleep Powder. And you're asleep now. Leech Seed. And you're parasited now. And Vine Whip. See, look at that. That's a super effective Vine Whip. And it did, you know, just no damage, essentially. Oh, are you going to die while you're asleep? Why you dead, Starmie? Why you dead? Uh, I would have liked two points of attack. Can, can a brother get two points of attack, please? It's your lowest stat. Wow, you're too much. Alright. You can have the Cascade Badge to show you beat me. I got a bunch of things. Cascade Badge makes all Pokemon up to level 30 obey. That's right. My Pokemon already obey me, though, because I am a strict master. That includes even outsiders you got in trades. Does it include wild Pokemon and Pokemon trained by other trainers? Because that would be a really useful ability. There's more. Oh, really? You can now use CUT anytime, even out of battle. Why did you yell cut like that? I didn't yell cut. Yes, you did. You went CUT! Oh, you're talking about CUT! 
and I'm turning into Eldritch Star. Use the force, Luke. You can cut down small trees to open new pathways. You can also have my favorite trademark! What? <coughs> I got TMO3. TMO3 teaches water pulse! Stop doing that! Use it on an aquatic Pokemon! <laughs> Wait, I went up. <laughs> I, I yelled out the wrong syllable. Okay, goodbye. Just in case you're wondering. We can go back here to the uh, TM case. Water Pulse is usable by absolutely nobody on my team. What's awesome is that I get all these wonderful TMs and Pokemon abilities, and I can't use one a single one of them. I can't even use any single one of them. <sighs> I'm going to save here. We're going to end this video at this point because we defeated the bridge. The bridge. We defeated Misty and got the badge. And up next time, we will get out of that house. I didn't tell... Get out of his house, man. Why do you got to be in somebody's house like that? We will fight the rainbow. Until next time, bye-bye.